God damn 2K land, man. Y'all already know what time it is, man. So listen, a lot of people thought that we were getting a demo, man. And this just covered, they just came straight out and and uh and, and just says, uh, <laughs> hey, look, it's just straight up J Bridge for stats confirms for a second time that there will not be a demo release tomorrow. Hey, Quavo says, hey, I don't know if they're dropping a demo or not, but I put this on everything. If I wake up tomorrow and we get a demo, I'ma lose my mind. And Stax just came through and said, you can sleep in, gang. Hey, it is what it is, man. So that lets us know. A lot of people thought because yesterday was Kobe's birthday and then today is Kobe day 824 that we may be getting a demo or what have you. But they went ahead and put that to bed and let us know that that is not happening. It was, it was cool to think about, you know, I mean, like I said, I think they did that in 2K24 or 21. Either they released current gen, on 824 or or they did so i can't remember what they did somebody let me know what they did down in the comment section man. i think they just released current gen on that day and then two weeks later they released uh next gen i could be wrong correct me if i am but uh before we get started make sure y'all like the video comment y'all thoughts down below y'all already know we're trying to go to the moon alice hey nobody told y'all this today y'all my family my people love each and every last one of y'all now we got to get to the news man because that boy mike wong been I say that boy Mike Wong been tweeting. <laughs> hey, he been doing his thing, man. I'm not going to lie to y'all, man. We're going to get into all that in one second. But before we get started, man, check this out. I want y'all to, hey, somebody asked me about my Breeze Tees infomercial, man. And, uh, yeah, we're we, we going to have that in one second. Hold on. I got the uh, I got the gameplay up there right now. But bow. Uh, 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 hold on. Hold on. Bam, there we go. Get some teas in the breeze when you're rocking with Breeze Tees. Somebody asked me about that Jalen Hurts shirt, man. Hey, I said I'm going to put it up there. We got it up there. You can get it in all colors, anything you want. We'll we'll do that. Also, man, I'm working on a couple of other joints, man. I got that Atlanta one. Obviously, y'all know I'm going to have that one. And then I got that uh, I got that soda for y'all, man. You know what I'm talking about, that, that Minnesota for y'all. So, hey, if y'all interested in any of those or you know what your favorite team is and it's not represented, y'all let me know. We're going to be putting some stuff up there. You know I got to put them Raiders and all that up there, man. Man, but hey, it is what it is. So, on to the tweets by Mike Wong, man. Y'all know I am the post of Mike Wong's Twitter. I was a little bit ill on yesterday, man. So, I wasn't able to um, get the information out like I wanted to. Um, I, I came in. I I uh, I tried to get everything right. And then, uh, you know how it is. That Theraflu hits you. My wife, she doped me up real good. So, I feel better now. But, man, when I'm telling y'all that that uh, I was I was feeling so slow and sluggish when I got on the Theraflu, and then I took some more and went on to sleep, so that's why I didn't do a stream or anything. Uh, also, we wanna tell y'all, man, we do have the, we got the, the rack, it's, and a lot of y'all, y'all probably see it as the, as the Rack Nation Discord or whatever right here. Let me show y'all right here, boom. You might see it as the Rack Nation Discord, man. That's probably gonna change. If you see that change, uh, it's gonna be either the Gemstar Discord or first team Discord, y'all. Let me know what we want, what we gonna go with, uh, first team or gym stars, y'all. But it's gonna be changing away from Rack Nation, so just just know that if you see that change, and you see that change to the gym star logo, that's what that is. But I want y'all to, if y'all have trouble finding people to play with stuff like that, join the Discord. We are rearranging and redoing it right now. We're trying to set it up. Uh, it's gonna be pretty much in the vein of all city live TV joints where y'all can, y'all, you know, we got we got our stuff. Y'all be able to see my new videos drop. We're gonna have a sub section where, you know, subs get access to information first. All the good stuff, man. So y'all just 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 uh, join that Discord. The link is perpetually down in the description. But anyway, now on to the tweets, man. Hey, listen, we just gonna go straight through them because we ain't got a lot of time, but we do got a lot of info. And one person said, hey, FTP says, uh, but there are... Uh, <laughs> But are they still gonna be shooting lakes? This this is what he said for rec bots will be noticeably better, uh, better time in their shots, but it's tough to balance. We want them to be competent, but not OP. Uh, we'll be looking out for you guys' feedback on on that next month. Now I'm gonna be, I'm not gonna I, I'm trying to be, I try to say this every way that I can, and I can't say it nicely, man. The bots are, I mean, they for the most part they do their jobs, but the way that the community has learned to abuse the bots. The bots struggle, I mean, they borderline in aptitude. When you have regular people that play the bots, like if you're playing a rec game with randoms and you get a couple of bots, those bots will probably be better than the randoms. But if you play a rec team and it's a team and you're, you know, somebody quits out, you could literally be up 30 points. They are going to abuse, absolutely abuse that bot and, and sometimes they can come back and win the game because they're going to cheese the bot. They're going to step back on the bot over and over. And then what they'll do is double team the ball handler, what have you, because they know that the bot is 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 pretty much a non-factor. So 
I am happy to hear this. I can't lie to you. I can't lie to y'all about that, man. It's something that I'm, I'm so happy to hear because a lot of times we play rake fives and that's what happens to us. And then, um, then uh, Qu Chrissy T says, not sure if you've spoken about it, but at least in the rake, when the AI, uh, when the will the A will either the AI will either clog the paint or just stand uh, stand in the way. Any way that we could that we could uh, get the AI to space the floor more or less. And now uh, that's something else. Like I said, the bots they 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 it's, they, it's borderline ineptitude. If you're playing a competent team, if you're playing a team that's not that's not really good or people that are not really good, then it's, it's probably not going to bother you at all with the bots. I'm just going to keep it a stack with y'all. So I am so happy that Mike came and said, Dazar and I hooked the team hooked hooked up a new motion freelance offense for Sim Nation underway in the gameplay coach. This is something else right there with the play vision and all of that. I wish you could do this in the rank. I would call five out every play for the bots. Bots. Get your ass out the paint and stop clogging it. You're a point guard. You're a five six point guard. Why the f are you in the paint? The dude that was controlling you gave you a 99 three ball bot. Why, why loud? Why fall loud you in the paint bot? Get out the f Bang. It's like Swan Tay used to say, man. That's all we saying, man. And then when you're doing it, when the bots does sit over there and he is wide open, he, he probably not going to knock down the shot. So it's tough, man. I know it's tough to balance because they don't want bots to be better than regular people. But in a lot of cases, that's going to be the case anyway. Hey, he also says no park uh, no park size ups per uh, per season. But also, this is somebody said, will there be cool park size ups in NBA, like, uh, like NBA 2K21? He says, no, no cool, no park size ups per season. But there are some uh, really cool park specific dribble moves that happen out of uh, how, that happen out of body up. So I, I guess that'll be cool, like nutmeg and other and one moves. So you probably gonna body somebody up into the dude make the right move. This is what's probably gonna happen to you. You gonna get nutmeg. I don't know how I feel about that because if I'm playing good D, then good D supposed to be good. It's, it's good defense supposed to be good defense, man. It is what it is. I don't know how I like it like that. But if you hit the right thing, you might be good. Hey, somebody says, Baluba, how many badges can we expect to see? And he says, 24 new badges in order, I mean, in honor of the Mamba. You can't say nothing more about that, man. 24 new badges in the game. Can't wait to see what those are. They didn't hint at what they are, but hey, it is what it is. Hey, Don says, at Baluba, at Baluba, in NBA 2K23, there's a there's a lot of misses, missed layups from big men, especially when you're seven when you got a seven three wingspan. Uh, jump high enough to see into the rim and pretty decent uh, pretty decent layup is NBA, is that fixed in 2K24? Uh, and he says bunnies are much easier to convert in 24. Like I said, man. You don't want it's it's a slippery slope, right? Because you want people to play defense. I shouldn't have to be seven three in order to stop you down there just because you're seven three. But at the same time, if it's a point guard down there, you should just be able to you should just about be able to go up with impunity. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. Bash plug says, aka Wadgy Pluggy. He says, What do you think the biggest skill gap in gameplay is in NBA 2K24? Mike says the dunk dunks, uh meter dunks and pass interceptions. Hey, listen, man. You see, you see that boy Laker fan. He always, anytime you make dunking harder, he takes it as a challenge, and that's what everybody should do when they when they nerf whatever it is. He said, heard it direct from the source. He looking at it like, shoot, hey, Slash the Nation about to be going crazy because now people gonna have to watch my videos in order to uh, you know what I'm saying, in order to learn how to get on that rim, oh rim, rim. On that rim for me. They're gonna have to watch my stuff, man. So it is what it is. Hey, Badger Pluggy, he just says, hey, he says, hey, it's a W. He said, that's a fake account, but I do like your videos, though. I'm with that. Hey, one other person says, uh, when y'all say that there's 150 dribble animations, is that for SIG size ups, moving crossovers, moving, you know, et cetera? He said, this is misinformation. I said there are 150 motion styles, not dribble animation. There are a lot, there are a lot more dribbles than uh, 25 dribble. 25 dribble styles, 31 back up, uh, 31 behind the backs, 18 step backs, 45 crossovers, 27 hezzies, 25, I mean 26 escapes, 20 combo packs, 120, 102 breakdown combos. Dang, boy. And then uh 67 size ups and 30 spins. Mike say I ain't playing no mother fucking games with y'all today. Let's say if you're what what's that what that what that means say? God damn it, if you think I'm here to play, I mean, if you think I'm here to play, God damn it, I'm not. Hey, that's what Mike is telling y'all today, man. Y'all better listen to this, young man. And he just says, somebody says, what is the minimum height for each position? 
uh, the minimum height for each position. So he says point guard, 5'7", shooting guard, you got to be six foot, small forward, you got to be 6'3", at least power forward, at least 6'6", six, six, and the cheesiest of the centers at 6'7". A lot of people going to be happy about that. They can make them 6'7 centers. I don't know if you're going to be good. You might as well be a small forward at that point, but I'm sure there'll be some advantage to it or what have you. Uh, he said, any idea how any idea how many more pass styles there are? And he says, I think we went from seven to tw seven and 23 to 14 and 24. So they doubled it up, man. This this tr this pro play is really making it so that they can have have more uh a lot more stuff, man. Hey, then uh I said Ice T says iced it. He says, uh, what's the max height for each position? He says uh six eight, six eight for point guard, six nine for shooting guard, six eleven for small forward, seven foot for power forward, and seven three for center. So right here it has been confirm that 7-4 is not in the game there you go that, i mean it, it, it is what it is um and, and, and we know that and uh, a lot of people was crying about that uh, about the other thing they they, they was out there ah, 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 joe knows joe knows joe knows is out there with a 6-9 point guard busting our ass it's nothing we can do about it he should not be able to beat pros he shouldn't be able to he shouldn't be able to compete with pros and win all these tournaments he's a casual he's a ca he's a casual you know what i say shut the f up shut the f up it's just like what sia said if y'all are gods and super gods why does a god need help if, if you really that good you can do the same thing that he's doing and be able to beat him you shouldn't be worried about that but i ain't gonna lie joe knows got some dogs around him on that joint but bauer is tough y'all need to go check out bauer stream uh hey that's one of the best locks in the game and all them guys that from bro that's crazy right there hey kmart he, he asked the question he says will will there be the same shot timing change uh, according according to where you are on the floor in nba 2k23 shooting shot timing doesn't change based on your location that doesn't really mean anything because because based on the location it doesn't really mean anything he just said based on location and he says a uh, viable shot timing has been toned a variable shot timing has been toned down this is what it's been toned down so it's still there but it's been toned down but it's not based on location i don't think it's been based on location in a, in in since since 2k21 it wasn't based on location it's just been based on the catches and stuff but hey it is what it is hey well one person says owen swan says uh type of shot meters that were in 2k23 are making a return are they making a return he says yes all of them shot all of the all of the shot meters uh in 2k23 are back and there are 10 new ones choose from lots of uh, lots more customization uh options to control to control the placement size too Oh, that's cool right there. So you control the, complac the placement and the size. I think they talked about that. It says several cool green effects coming as well. So that's going to be dope, man. We're going to get those right there. And then uh, last but not least, we got my boy Blizzy saying, hey, they said that that the, uh, he says, hey, Brutal Sam, you know, he said, they crying about the post scores. Let them cry. Build to stop us. Uh, don't cave in. And I'm saying, I ain't going to, I'm not going to lie to y'all, man. I'm cool with that as long as it's not like it was when the game came out last year, or should we say yesteryear, when the game came out last year, you weren't able to get a contest at all on, on post scores. As long as they do it right, I think post scores being OP is completely fine, but you know, they have to do it right, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Let me know what other shirts y'all wanna see on the site, as far as, you know, your team and all of that good stuff. And I'm gonna holler at y'all next time, till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, AKA Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Chapel. Guys, speak.